Hey, what's up guys, Scampif here, and welcome to Team of the Week 28, which to me actually looks pretty damn awesome. In the comments below and in the straw poll on top description, make sure you let me know which players you want me to review tonight and throughout the week. And uh, yeah, apart from that, we're just going to have a quick little rundown of this Team Week, which to me actually looks pretty awesome. But I have noticed EA have favoured pretty much all the major leagues. We've got a bunch of League 1, a bunch of Bundesliga, a bunch of BPL, and so on players. So uh, yeah, seems like EA have favoured the major leagues this week, but uh, we'll see. Let's have a quick rundown of some of the players anyway. So starting off in goal with Inform Becky, who actually looks like a really nice goalkeeper for someone with 77 rated overall some pretty insane diving and reflex stats which is nice to see at right back we've got Koke who um if he had 80 pace would definitely look more appealing but overall looks like a very nice right back with some really good rounded stats to be honest 63 shooting and 73 passing on a right back not bad at all we've got PK with that 89 defending looking pretty crazy obviously getting his in uh, this in form for his performance in the El Clasico and then next to him we have an 81 paced centre back Rod Fanny, which to be honest is a bit overdue. He could have had an inform multiple times throughout the year, been really good for Marseille, and um, yeah, looking like a pretty OP inform that we're probably never going to see on the market. He's going to be an insta sell inform, and um, yeah, looks pretty crazy to be honest. Him and Koscielny at the back, wow, that would be one French OP combination. We've got Jan Moutinho up next, looking like a very nice camp, along with Maxim, the five star skiller, who's got some pretty OP looking stats on his card. Fernando's up next, looks like a very good CDM slash centre mid, I, once again he looks pretty well rounded as well, 63 shooting, 73 passing, not bad at all, and then we've got Juan Mata, sadly we knew it was going to happen, he is a winger card, which is a bit of a shame really because obviously he doesn't have the best of pace, but still some insane dribbling will definitely help him out, really good shooting on his card as well which is good to see, and some uh, really nice passing, his physical stats aren't actually that bad either. Inform Raphael for his two goals against Bayern Munich, who actually looks really good with that 84 shooting, 70 physical, and 87 dribbling. May have to pick that guy up and give him a go. And then we've got informed, uh, second inform Druid, I think this is. I actually didn't expect Druid to get the inform this week just for two goals, but um, hey ho, I think he deserves it. Guy's on fire at the moment, and 86 shooting on his card, and 88 physical. Pretty crazy attributes, but um, yeah, weren't too keen on this guy's first inform slash man of the match. Anyway, there is one more player to talk about in starting 11. And that is second in form Ibrahimovic, who um, I've got no idea what EA are going to put this guy's price range at, but um, yeah, I'm probably not going to be able to get my hands on it, so sorry if you do want to see second in form Ibra review. I'm going to search right now, probably will be unlikely just because I might not be able to get one off the market, but if I can get my hands on it, obviously I will review that guy as quickly as possible. So looking at the bench now, there is obviously one player that stands out, and that is a third in form Harry Kane, which looks insane with that 85 shooting. We've got Inform Kanate, who um, scored like five goals in these like past two games, really good to see. Inform Akbar looking very nice for bronze lovers. Ainsworth with the pace. Sapanara looking like he got really OP stats for a silver to most. Jim Larson, and then the goalkeeper who made 13 saves, uh, penalty save, and kept clean sheet, Bettinelli. So overall, a good looking team of the week in my opinion. Anyway, comments below, let me know which players you want me to review. Make sure you go vote on the straw poll, and I'll see you tonight for the reviews. Adios.